Welcome back, looters. Uh, today, Carrie has gotten us a big box of snacks to try, which is pretty exciting. It is the Hello Sanrio Mystery Snack Box. Hashtag not sponsored. Still, no one still wants to pay us. Still, no one's paying us. I haven't heard from Dippin' Dots still. Very disappointed. Get on it, Dippin' Dots. We don't have grandpa's knife. With grandpa's knife. You're the one with grandpa's knife. You wanted me to name all the Sanrio characters. I do. I want you to name all the Sanrio. This that's your test right I don't, now. I don't name know all, all of them. the Sanrio's characters. I can get a few. So I know Hello Kitty, obviously. I know Bats Maru, who is the penguin. Purin is the little dog. Uh, Melody, the bunny. Kiropi, the froggy. Uh, Choco Cat, the cat. <laughs> um, who else do we have? A weird burger. I don't know who he is. I don't know. I don't know the names of the little angels. I know they're like twins. The one's a boy and one's a girl, and I don't know this penguin. But I feel like that's pretty good. That's I feel like I good. did. I did pretty good. You did really good. Wanna have me on my new? Hello Kitty. <laughs> I've heard of the dog, okay? <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, it's very cute on the inside. There's there's a cute little picture of all of our friends rolling in the kitty mobile. Kitty mobile. Alright, so to start with, we have some. Oh God. Calm down, box. We still don't have a yet another sponsor of we, Kit Kat. We have some uh, awesome Kit Kats that are in Japanese. Here, read this for me. Carrie knows a little bit of Japanese. I am my guess. Matcha. No. It's not They're green. <laughs> I know, I know, but it doesn't say matcha. Oh. My guess is matcha because they're green. Well, because so that's Kit Kat No. Um, but my guess is this is going to be like some sort of like snack. Or mm. It's matcha. You know, I'm going to be have a confession for you. I don't actually know what, I know what the flavor of matcha tastes like. Matcha. For those of you who don't know, is like the flavor of green tea. So it's very like herbaceous. It has that like very earthy flavor to it. And I don't know that I can compare it to anything else because it's very unique. What do you think? How do you like it? I like matcha a lot. Like snack foods that have matcha tend to not be very sweet. And I like that person. It's not very sweet. No, this is not sweet like at all. Which probably means you don't like it. It's very... It's almost bitter because of the tea flavor. It has those like tannins to it. Your face says you do not like this. So these are going in my pile. The yummy flavor of grass. I, I like that. Mmm, grass flavored. I love it. <laughs> mm. It's for those of you who prefer a snack that's like not so sweet. That's not me. I I'm aware. <laughs> okay, next we have a Hello Kitty cookies. They're very lightweight. They look like nothing. Oh boy. I should prefer them uh, from now on as non-sponsor. So our non-sponsor of... Uh... <laughs> our non-spawn. <laughs> non-spawn. Hashtag non-spawn. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh, what is it? I don't know, but it scared me. I was expecting a cookie. I don't think it's a cookie. I'm gonna try this again. I'm sorry. Mm -mm. It's like a cheese cracker. Yeah, it's not. It's not a cookie. Mm -mm, not a cookie. I went into it expecting like a wafer cookie. But it's it's like savory. Savory. Yeah. It's almost cheesy. Oh god, do you think it's shrimp? 
No. Not shrimp? Like a, you know what I mean? Like a fish? Yeah, I know. It, it, to me, it's like a cheese, like a... I love cheese. This isn't cheese. Well, it's like when you get a cheese cracker, like, they don't taste like cheese. No, no, to me, it's, it is, it's a different whole palette. That's what I'm saying. It's not, I don't put it under cheese. I put it under... Oh, I finally figured out the flavor. There's no guide. It 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 hits the salt notes that my um, the popcorn does. You know what I'm talking about? That the the additional seasoning you add on to popcorn. Mm -hmm. You know how it gets like. I didn't say it was good. Uh, I don't like it. <laughs> my, did my face say that I liked it? It's. Mm -mm. It, it's. I have a feeling that this is gonna taste not very unsimilar. This, is, this one is in kanji, so that's less oh. helpful. Uh, atsu. Let's see. I tried. Atsu. There's a pun in this room. Ah, pun. Bread. That's pun. helpful. It's a cracker thing, and they called it bread. Yeah, we got that. It's not helpful, Carrie. She's not I just told you it's bread. Really? I'm so surprised by this new information. Oh my god, I can't open it. Open. Don't break into 10,000 pieces. Mm. Mm. Bread. Mm. This one kind of smells like caramel. Maybe? I hope. Please be sweet. Oh, it's not sweet. Why aren't, why isn't anything in this box sweet? Oh no. Mmm. Mmm. I don't like it. This one literally tastes like popcorn. But I like popcorn and I don't like Not in a- not This one in, I want to say is cheese flavored too. Yeah, not in a butter flavored popcorn. In a not butter flavored popcorn. Mm. Like in a, like in a. And it's harder than the other one. At least the other one was kind of like melted in your mouth. This one is very like crunchy. Yeah, it's not is... bad. I don't know that I would eat it if, unless like I was really hungry and this was at my house in my pantry waiting to be eaten. I don't like it. It's fine, but I, I will not be eating more of it. Stop trying to read ahead. <laughs> oh, this one is gonna be good. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go to something nicer. I don't know what Pocky is. There's Pocky. We'll save Pocky. Those. Okay. Pocky, if you'd like to sponsor us, we would love to be your would love to be your sponsor. Okay. We'll go to something Eat. nice next. Hello Kitty Strawberry Chew. That's nice. That's gonna be a candy that tastes like stra- If this tastes like cheese, I'm gonna be so <gasps> mad. Please don't taste like cheese. They're like strawberry chew. <laughs> no, with cheese flavor. I'm gonna cry. Ah. Like a little a little button. Little cheesy button. Oh, that's nice. Very soft. Oh my gosh. Kind of like a marshmallow. It is this the lightest little flavor. It's like not flavor, I'm texture. It's that's nice. Mm. Cleanse the palate after the weird cracker thing. A nice Sanrio mystery box. Cheese and also strawberry. It will be fun. It will be fun, she said. There's no way anything will be nasty in There'll this. There'll be nothing said. in here. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do is we're each gonna have one ramen oh. because there's one that's pineapple and it's very cute, but as previously stated, I don't do pineapple. And the other one is strawberry, but I like strawberry. So we can each have a nice little drink. And if you've never had a ramen soda before, it's kind of just like a flavored soda. They have them in lots of different flavors, including weird flavors. I've seen um, kimchi flavored ramen. I've seen um, uh, pickled plum flavored ramen. Like there's lots of weird 
flavors that they make in addition to the nice ones like melon and pineapple and grape. So what you have to do is you have to get this little plunger out of the top, you put the plunger on, and then you plunge. And the ball goes down. Oh God. The ball. Mine is exploding. It's a marble. It's a marble inside. It's a little glass marble. And it's right there and it goes down. And so now it is no longer stops closed. And it will uh, continue to stay in there and you cannot get it out unless you break the bottle. So don't do that. No matter how much you want it, no matter how cute you think it would be to have little tiny glass balls. All right. So now that we have a nice little refreshing beverage, let's move, let's move on to something that I don't think either one of us is going to like very much. Roasted seaweed. <sighs> I know your son likes this snack. I wonder how many of these snacks we're going to give to my kid. I mean, most of them is what you told me. <laughs> She's like, we don't need to worry about it. We'll just give them to him. So what's, what was fascinating is I thought it was going to be a bunch of sugary gummy things that I was going to be like, okay, that's it. Done with the gummy. And that has not been the case. It's been a mixture of savory. Oh, I'm just going to rip one of these sheets in half because mm. I think that's going to be more than enough for each one of us. It's a very, very green little paper thing. You know what? It is actually kind of pretty. It is. Uh, I don't know that that means I want to eat it. It's very green. Can we see? Can we see? It is kind of pretty. Like in an artsy, an artsy kind of way. But then we have to eat it. That's where it all goes downhill. Tastes like seaweed. There's not a lot of flavor on it. No, just a little bit of salt. Yeah. The so, if you've never eaten seaweed before, think of like the flavor of the ocean. Like if you get too much ocean water in your mouth when you go to the beach, and that's kind of what seaweed tastes like. It's very oceany. Yeah, but they usually when you do seaweed snacks, they have powder on them. Powder to make a different flavor, and those ones are roasted seaweed flavor. Roasted seaweed flavor. My son's gonna love it. He's gonna think we are the nicest people in the world for giving him seaweed. Mmm. There we go. Her son also goes into the fridge and just steals like bok choy to eat. <laughs> so choices are made sometimes, you know. <laughs> he does. Alright. He really does. So next is Agretzko, my favorite Sanrio character. Uh Ramane flavored chewy candy. So I'm gonna assume that that's gonna be similar to this nice Hello Kitty chewy candy. What's Ramune flavor? Um, so the, the original, the standard flavor of ramen is like a lemon lime soda. So Can I'm assuming lemon lime. I was have that kind of like a bubble gum. Nope. It's like a like a. I think it's supposed to be like a lemon. Lime. It definitely smells. Like oh lemon yeah, lime. it's 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 the it is a hundred percent. That is the smell of the um, the original ramen. Smells good. Mm -hmm. It smells like bubble gum. It tastes good. Oh, interesting. This has cotton candy powder on it. Probably on the outside hmm. to make it not stick to each other. Mm. And a little bit of sodium bicarbonate to make it a little bit fizzy in your mouth. Mm, that explains the texture I was talking about. There's a weird. There's Those a weird... are really good. I would just buy these to have at my house. All right. Like Next seaweed. is Hello Panda green tea flavored. As we previously described, green tea, kind of earthy. These ones are probably going to have some actual like sugar in with it to make it more um, kid friendly. You mean like the Kit Kat? No, unlike the Kit Kat. <laughs> the Kit Kat was clearly more of a like an adult design. So that was going to be less sugary. This one is probably going to be mixed with some like white chocolate or something to make it a little bit less um, herbaceous. The cookies themselves are green. I never really like I liked these kind of cookies as a kid, but like they're supposed to have little pictures on them and you never really can tell. And my panda has a hole through his head, so that's a little bit scary. <laughs> Like, they're supposed to have little pandas on them. Okay, mine does not look like a panda. I 
thinking I guess like the head? snowboarding, maybe. Oh, that's the head. Mm -hmm. Not that? This is like a gorilla face. <laughs> no, I think that's a little mask. Okay, I officially do not know <laughs> what this is. It's definitely snowboarding. Oh. Is that him? Is it a no. pong ball? No. I don't know. No. A race car? He literally looks like he's skiing or something. Okay, he's probably snowboarding. I don't know. <laughs> Try it. These I like too. Alright, you guys want to see? <laughs> no guarantee you'll be able to see this. There, oh, it goes. there it goes. There it goes. Tell us below what you think this little guy is doing. Because <laughs> we don't know. So now Carrie will try eating it instead of just staring at it creepily. a hole in the middle. Yeah, to put the green tea chocolate. I'm trying to identify. It's very light flavor. It almost had the flavor a second ago. Well, this one looks like a baseball player. None of them are very well printed. It's hard to print on a cookie. Like, you're already, Gee, setting think so? <laughs> You're already setting yourself up for a hard time. <laughs> what do you think? Better or worse than the Kit Kat? Better than the Kit Kat. Still wouldn't buy it. <laughs> I like these too. You like sugarier. I definitely don't. Okay. Next we have rice crackers, strawberry, senbei. What does senbei mean? I don't know. It's exciting. Oh my god. Please open. It's, it's more cracker things, so I'm scared. It's been successful so far. <laughs> Every time there's a cracker thing. Is it? Is it? It's two. It's two? Oh, it's got... It has little pink on it. That's probably whatever sunbay is. Like the little dot things. Little fake frosting things. It smells like strawberry. It says it has sugar, so here we go. It lies. It fooled me again! All right, so the reality is there's, I, I finally figured out the flavor, rice cakes. Yeah, it's just, this one is just literally a rice cake. It's a rice cake. So it is a rice cake that is smaller than a normal rice cake, because rice cakes are usually very big. It is much smaller than a rice cake. And that is its flavor. It's rice cake. It has strawberry on top. With strawberry on top. It is rice cake with strawberry on top. It doesn't really taste like anything. The strawberry is not very strong. Also, it's not sweet. Well, rice cake's not sweet. It says sugar on the back. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> so this was in the sweet section, in case you're wondering. This was gonna be a sweet mystery box. Technically, nothing ever says it's a sweet mystery box. It just says mystery snack box. What <laughs> did we go into with the big con miscon temptations? All right. So as Carrie finishes her snack things, rice cake of death. <laughs> um, next we have Naruto, who I did not think was a Sanrio character. I know. But all right. Uh, Naruto Kompeto, which is like sugar candy, so like hard pieces of hard candy um, that are shaped like irregular little spiky things that they call sugar stars. So um, this one 
is yellow. And the other one is blue. Let me see if I can show you some of these. <laughs> you just watch Carrie eat her thing. There we go. There we go. So some sort of spiky, irregular shaped sugar things. Uh, that they call a competo or sugar stars. And we have yellow. So you're gonna, you're gonna finish that up. <laughs> I'm done. All right. So we have yellow and we have blue. So first is yellow. And we'll see if these actually have any flavor. Oh boy. Oh no. Guess what yellow is. Oh, yep, it is. It's pineapple. That's what yellow is. It's not lemon. It's pineapple. Why? If there's a country that I think of as being very popular for pineapple, I'm just not reading the back. <laughs> It's like cheating. It does say pineapple flavoring. Blech. Name that flavor. Blech. Flavor was pineapple. We successfully named that flavor. Gonna try blue next. Oh, blue This one has like a scary Naruto on it. Look at him. What is he doing? Boy, terrifying. Gotta be blue pineapple, right? Blue raspberry, right? Blue pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so mad. Yeah, I think that's just. Oh, well, is it cotton candy? It tastes like blue. Flavoring cider. <laughs> I almost swallowed it. Ow! <laughs> what? Okay, if you understand what flavoring cider means... Because that's what that. I think... If that's what I think of when I think blue, there I think... Go. I think cider. <laughs> if you know what that means, if you know what this is supposed to actually taste like, please let us know. It just tastes like blue. It's not bad, it tastes like blue. I don't think it tastes like cotton candy. It tastes sweet. Mm -hmm. I feel like blue cotton candy, and then I looked at the flavor and it's cider. cider. Last snack. Last snack. Last snack. Hello Kitty, what are these called? Moon pies? Moon pies. Hello Kitty Moon Pies. Chocolate coated pie. So cute. Chocolate. Should be sweet. May taste like cheese. <laughs> Who knows? Somehow it ended up tasting like cheese. Big, big snack. Big snack. Bites back? What is that? Goldfish. <laughs> oh, okay. Smiles back. Bites. I don't know. Werewolf snacks. <laughs> Alright, this is the this, snack that bites you back. This video has gone south. It always does. <laughs> it's just a moon pie. It tastes good. Chocolate. It's a little dry. We got soda. It's alright. It's a moon pie. It does not bite you back. It's just a nice little moon pie. It's a moon pie. So, uh, if, you, if you see one of these, Hello Kitty boxes. Is it worth it? You're scared. Uh, You're very, very scared. Uh, if you want to try a bunch of snacks you maybe have never tried before, yeah, there's there's a lot of variety here. You can try maybe some stuff you've never even heard of before, like weird cheese cracker or weird salt cracker. 
you can try some stuff that was really good that you may not be able to find other places like the chewy candy um yeah it's kind of a kind of a mixed bag do you feel like it was worth the value of, of what you paid for it i'm i don't know but i'm glad we did it as a video because you could watch us make faces <laughs> so much pineapple in here. Wow, that's an odd face for sweets. Oh, because it's not sweet. Okay. All right, so if you haven't already, go follow us on this account, Loot Off The Record. Um, it has lots of other stuff like this where we're just like having fun that isn't board game related or game related at all. And uh, you can be one of the super cool kids to get in on it on the ground floor. If you have any other ideas for things you want to watch us make fools out of ourselves doing, please let us know. <laughs> please stop torturing us. We do that to ourselves. As you can tell on our own, we don't need you to help. And we'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs>